Hey guys, back in with yet another unboxing video. I know, two unboxing videos back to back almost within the same day. Actually, these are all probably all going to be in the same day on the 31st most likely at this rate. The 30th when I'm recording this, but it's late and with my new sleep schedule, I'm probably going to go to bed here in a minute. But, so we here, I've got December's crate. Phoenix, we're almost in February. Like I said in the update video, guys, I'm way behind. The previous video was actually for November. So, I think I might have failed to mention that, but let's just go on with this. So for this for, for this up unboxing video, the theme is stealth. So it looks like we got looking at the box. We definitely have very much of a theme. It looks like Assassin's Creed, and I believe this one actually um from one of the pieces I saw in here, looks like um actually clips onto this. So Oh, but first, this hat came in it. I think this thing is pretty cool. Let's see here. If I remember correctly, this is like a Full Metal Panic. I have, or I haven't seen it wrong, but we'll double check when we get to the poster. Oh, I almost forgot the shirt. The shirt. Ta -da! Wanted for the murders of various individuals of note. This masked miscreant, enemy of the city of Dunwall, reward of 10,000 coins for capture or death. The offenses of this man are high crimes under the laws of the city watch of Dunwall, the edicts of our brave lord regent in these times of peril. Reward will be paid in coin by the city watch in addition to rewards offered by private citizens on outstanding organizations. This is from Dishonored. I think this is actually pretty cool. A lot of text on there, though, so... But I like it. And also, if you guys haven't got Loot Crate stuff, the shirts are soft. They're really nice. Alright. So, getting into here. Open this up. We've got... From Magic the Gathering. Or wait, no, 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 no. Is this one I got here, or is this something somebody gave to me? I forget. Well, I'll show it anyways. We'll, we'll figure out here. We got Tezreth, Magic the Gathering. We've got in. So we've got a Scarab Beetle, Gold Scarab Beetle, actually, for the pin this month. Or should I say uh, that month? Get up very close. Hopefully the light reflector off won't make it. Too bad. Ah, uh, there we go. There it focuses in. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's put this back in here in a minute. Let's go through here. And like I said, the only thing I clip on there is this guy. Yeah, I think I'm getting a lot of reflection off from the. Uh, it actually, looks like that's off the um, computer back there. But yeah, let's, uh, again, let's try this in this bit. Let's put it on the red background. Maybe that'll help focus it all. Ta da! Ooh, wow, that, that, that's straight light. Let's put it at an angle, maybe. Maybe that'll do it. I'll figure this out eventually, guys. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You know, it's on the uh, sides, got the Assassin's logo. The back says this is a uh, Bayek. Strike your enemies from the shadows as Bayek, the last Medje, and take to the disguise as his evil companion Sinu in Assassin's Creed Origins. Use stealth and deadly fighting skills to experience the mysteries of ancient Egypt and discover the origins of the Assassin Brotherhood. Looks like we're just going further and further from back in time. Oh, I didn't notice that. His eagle's actually in there. That's, that's kind of cool. But I'm not that good at that stuff, so... A lot of my, I've got a lot of staff stuff over here. I've got Assassin's Creed Black Flag. I've got uh, Dragon Inqu Inquisition. A lot of stuff is gonna stay in the box until I actually have a, a place to put the stuff. Until then, that's not happening. I'm not taking it out and risk losing it. I'm leaving it in the boxes. And for the most part, the cooler. I mean, there's a lot of 
Okay, here's one thing is I got a few like cute and deadly ones, right? Uh, I think they're actually over here. They're not pop figures, but however, I'm starting up my own pop collection. That's a wholly different video. But with the cute and deadly figures, like in the mystery boxes, you have to take them out of plastic, and they don't have a little box put in. You have to go and buy that separately to put it in. When you get something like this, it's already in a box. I like that. So, let's see if this one was actually in here if I got it somewhere else. Which I might have gone it for another Christmas. Everything's kind of got mixed up. Uh, nope, it's my, yep, I got that one. It's a mystery figure. All right. So it's, uh, oh, it's like this. This is badass. Personally, if I had my way, I would, oh my gosh, there's a hole right here. I personally would wish it, guys, if they would, like, maybe, like, roll them up. I mean, it might mean making the box a little longer, so maybe that's a little cost more costly on them. But the condition of these, I mean, I've got posters up here that have been hanging for a while, and they're just not starting to flatten out. And I like them, but these lines across them, I want to have these up on my walls. Every single poster I have will eventually be on a wall somewhere. If not in the house, because the wife will probably get fed up with like, there's too much gaming stuff around here. Let's take it up all this. Let's put, let's put up a, a nice picture. Let's put a kitty picture here. No more video game stuff up on the walls. It just means that when I get the garage, the grass is mine. <laughs> we'll, we'll figure that out. All right. Oh, let's look at this right here. So, yeah, so that's the Creed Origins bag figure. Metal Gear Solid. Metal Gear Solid. Okay. Alert hat. Um, Dishonored Wanted T-shirt. Scare pin. Magic the Gathering Funko Pop. It's a mystery one. So looks like there were several other ones that we could have gotten. We got Tizrith. So there's possibly like two other ones. Ah, wait no. Eleven altogether. And for this one, we had an Xbox One X Epic Drop. So like one lucky winner received it. That's made it a value of five hundred dollars. Oh, and a little blurb here with up here where it says still. Gotta read this out. There are gods everywhere, and getting caught is just not an option. You'll have to take them out one by one using stealth. Equip yourself with sneaky exclusives from Assassin's Creed Origins, Metal Gear Solid, Dishonored, and Magic the Gathering. You'll notice in a lot of games, I prefer the stealthy approach. I don't like getting to conf confrontations if I can avoid it, which unfortunately in some of the major games which I've been playing lately causes some issues. More commonly like with uh, Rainbow Six Siege, if you guys are watching me, you guys know I am not that good of a siege player. That's because I take my time. I hold on an angle. Now, if my reaction time could ho hold up. Yeah. If I can maybe not be so serious when I play the game. That's another. Like, Crisis. Oh, that's a good game. I started that playthrough. I need to finish that one. Crisis is really, really good. Yeah, I know I'm out of frame, guys. I'm just trying to get this off the ground so the dog comes in they don't start chewing on my box. He doesn't really do that a whole lot, but maybe I can be too careful. Um, but yeah. That's about it for the box, guys. Yeah, and a follow-up of the two previous videos and the update video. If you guys have any games you want me to try, please let me know. Um, if you guys enjoy what I'm doing or if you have any tips... Hey, let me know. If there's a new tactic you want me to try in a video game, I'm more than willing to try it. Thank you guys for your time. Hope you guys enjoy the video. See you guys in the next one.